close your eyes, focus on your breath. When you breathe in, notice where you feel the breath. When you breathe out, notice where you feel the breath. And focus on those sensations. As for anything else, just let it pass. Let it pass. Try to be sensitive, as sensitive as you can to how the breathing feels in the body. You might want to start with a couple of good long, deep in and out breaths to emphasize the breath. And give yourself a little extra energy. And then allow the breath to find a rhythm that feels good. This is a part of our awareness that we tend not to pay attention to. And yet it has a huge impact on our life. If you're carrying around a lot of tension in the body or feeling of low energy in the body, then whatever else you have to deal with in life becomes a big issue. People say things you don't like and it becomes a big burden, big weight on the mind. People do things you don't like or you're called to do things that you know are difficult. It gets really hard if you don't have the energy and you don't have the sense of well-being inside. So this is one very simple and very direct way of living your life in a better way, making sure that you get the proper breath energy. And then when you look at what needs to be done in your daily life in terms of problems you have to face or responsibilities you have to take on, you're ready for them. You have greater strength. You have greater a greater sense of well-being and a willingness on the one hand, to look at what's right and what's wrong, and the strength to do what's right and to abandon what's wrong. So it's in this way that the meditation is a gift to yourself and to the people around you. It helps weaken your greed and your aversion and your delusion, which means the people around you don't have to become victims of your greed, aversion, and delusion. And that's a huge gift right there. <laughs> So take the time to acquaint yourself with the breath energy in the body. Because the breath is not just the air coming in and out of the lungs, it's the flow of energy that you can feel in different parts of the body as you breathe in, breathe out. And as you get more sensitive to this energy, you find that it's all over the body. It's already happening, but in some cases it's not happening in a comfortable way, or there's a sense of blockage or there's a sense of conflict in the energy flows in the different parts of the body. But if you sit with this long enough, you can begin to sort things out. So you can take good energy with you wherever you go. And that's nourishing both for the body and for the mind. So try to be in touch with this aspect of your awareness as much as you can as you go through the day. Make this your foundation. It's not just one more thing you got to think about. It's the place where you take your stance. This is the place where you move in and inhabit your body, you inhabit time through the breath. And then when you're firmly established here, other things become a lot easier. <laughs>